Hey everybody, it's Old School Nerd, it's Friday, and we just did our Leo reaction, holy hell. Whew. I'm exhausted, but let's continue on. Um, we're still catching up to our super chat from last week, so let's continue on. This next request comes from Magnet Hero. Magnet Hero says, hey, let's react to Maximum the Hormone, let's talk about the future. Here's the thing, I have never done Maximum the Hormone, and many of you have asked for it, and I am so sorry that it's taken this long. So you guys send uh, Magnet Hero a thumbs up. Thank you for uh, getting that through. I do. I should have done this a long time ago, but we're getting to it now. Like, subscribe to the channel. Thank you very much for coming in. Check us out on oldschoolnerd.com, oldschoolnerd.com. It's got our merchandise store, the Patreon, and of course all the social media links for all of you. Check out, see what we're doing there. Let's check out Maximum the Hormone. I'm pretty sure if it doesn't get blocked, I may have to do some little editing because this, I know who represents them, so we'll see how long. Hopefully, you guys will be able to see this. If you're seeing this now, if you never see this, then I'm talking to nobody. Here we go. Maximum the Hormone. I'm old school nerd. I've been asked so many times to react to this, so let's see what happens. I don't speak Japanese, so I have no idea what's being said. It's to be a fan of Maximum the Hormone, and she's watching a video, and that's them doing a green screen dance around. Doesn't look all that excited about it. Um, looks like it's about to get ugly. Uh, <laughs> Jesus. Um, I have no idea what all that's about. If someone who does speak Japanese or knows could put in the comment section below, say, hey, old school. This is what was going on. This is what was being said. I want to know. Because as many of you that love this band, all these little things in here mean something to someone. So I want to know about them. Let me know, guys. Japanese flea over there on that base just running it with those long ass Akazan red <laughs> dreads. If you know who Akazan is, he's a YouTube personality. He's got the dreads with the red, you know. But um, what a groove. What a deep guttural groove. Um, the Japanese dime bag Daryl puking on that girl's phone was kind of a little bit over the top, but we're going to go with it. Oh, no, 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 no,
What the hell is going on? Is that the drummer singing that too? I'm asking because I don't know. And and the drummer, her name is Nao, right? Is it Nao? I'm looking at it. Nao. The bassist is Ui Chan. Uh, the guitarist's name is Maximum the Rio. And Daisuke is the vocalist. I just want to say, um, I just wanted to make sure the drummer's name, what her name was. But um, I really dig. I know this part is not what we were just listening to, but that tag style that she was doing, the groove, heavy groove push, but she would throw in those little tags with the symbols and a really like that a lot. I really like that a lot. Oh my god. <laughs> I love that break style with the tags from the from the drummer. I love that. Um, the sound is so heavy for a three piece. Again, they're a three piece, three piece instrumental with a vocalist. They're a four piece band, three piece. It's extremely heavy. It's extremely layered. It's the arrangement is amazing. I love the drummer tags. This guitarist. I called him the Japanese Dimebag Daryl because of the way he vomited and the and the stance he was taking just reminded me of Dimebag. He plays like Dimebag too. It's it's heavy. It's heavy, heavy, like aggressively. Whew. Definitely maximum. Definitely maximum. I, I get why his name is Maximum the Ria or Rio. Is that Ria? I'm looking at it. Um, Rio, maximum the Rio. <laughs> <laughs> Whoa, whoa, okay. Number one, he's picking his nose, that's weird, but okay, let's let's ignore this part and realize Yui Chan is the name of the bassist, he's the one singing and playing this man i could tell that he was an amazing bassist but he's also singing this is that real tell me in the comments i have no idea what i'm getting into here you guys have asked me to do maximum the hormone for months and i was like okay but there were so many other japanese bands that i was doing i didn't want to i was trying to balance the load between europe and japan and Remember, it was Nightwish and, and Bandmaid and, and Baby Metal and, and Love Bites and Amareth, Sabaton. It was, I was going back and forth so much that I missed them. That was a huge mistake. Wow. I, that was a huge mistake. And now I'm paying for it, but I'm glad we're doing it now. Thank you, Magnet Hero, for forcing me to do this because I would have missed out on something really awesome. I'm going to back it up just a little bit. If, if this is the bass player doing this part, let me know because not only is he playing something really amazing, but if that's his vocal, oh my God. Oh, 
Okay, that might have been Maximum the Rio doing the, the vocal part of, of that bass breakdown. Yeah, that's, that's, okay. I, I, okay, I see the difference. So it was Maximum Rio doing the vocal for uh, Yui Chan. I was like, holy crap. Because, don't get me wrong, already we've got a screamer, this soft-spoken, just smooth vocal, and then the aggressiveness, and the, the drummer was flipping me out, and now this bass player's throwing down licks that were making me just And then, hmm. <laughs> Now, the woman singing this part, that's not Nao, the drummer, right? This is just another singer that they have doing this little part here to be the, the antithesis of what they're doing. You know, they're, it's fli flipping itself on its end. Is this about gluttony or food or, or dieting or something? Is this like self-image? Is that what this is about? I don't speak Japanese, so I'm going off the imagery and it just... This thing goes so many different places. I mean, literally, it goes so many places. It's almost, it's literally close to an overwhelming experience how many things are going on here, which is really awesome. By the way, I do realize that this is Maximum the Hormone Brothers with the font from Mario Brothers, and I, I've already caught that. Thank you, Magnet Hero. Okay, so is Nao the drummer? Is she the one singing that part? Because it, it looks like her. Am I wrong? How multi talented are these four people? Holy crap. <laughs> They are really good. That is so crazy. Oh my god. I was not ready for this at all. I didn't I didn't even understand. I do now. Um Oh my god. This is beyond what I thought. Whew. Okay, that's maximum the hormone. And my name is Old School Nerd.
don't know what to say. Holy hell. Um, they're on the playlist, obviously. You got to put them up there with everybody else. Everything else we've seen, Sabaton, Nightwish, Amareth, Love Bites, Bandmade, Baby Metal, The Warning, you name it. Torrential Rain, all these imageries and everything else. I can't get over how good the drummer is. And if this is her singing that song, she's got a good voice too. And then the bass player. And then you have the screamer in, in Rio, the, the, the Maximum the maximum the Rio. Playing everything. Everything is dead on the money. I'm assuming the theming is about food and gluttony and body image, whatever. I don't know. But wow. The chaos of all of this. Okay. All right. I, I got to go. I got to go. Um, <laughs> I got to go take a walk. <laughs> I got to. I got to bring this down. <sighs> I'm going to wind up having a panic attack from a vi music video. That's how good it was. <laughs> wow. God, I am so sorry. I didn't get to them before now. And I've really missed out. Thanks, guys.